Johan, why do different cars have different leader engines? Because not every ride needs a cinematic soundtrack under the hood. Engine leaders measure displacement, the volume all pistons sweep through each cycle. A 1.5 liter engine moves 1.5 liters of air fuel mix. Simple as that. So it's like measuring how much air your lungs hold? Exactly bigger lungs, louder screams, big ones. Like 3.5 liter are monster truck lungs. It has more torque and smooth revs. Ideal for towing or highway cruising. Small ones like 1.0 liter turbos are tiny but mighty, sipping fuel and spitting power only when revved hard. So big engine, equal chill power, and small turbo need to rev to party? Let's break it down. Large engine is strong, low-end grunt. It has smooth vibe, but heavier, thirstier, and could empty your wallet while small turbo is lightweight and efficient, but can whine when hauling groceries. So like choosing between a comfy SUV and a zippy scooter? Exactly. Also, modern cars has turbocharging, which is a direct injection to help small engines mimic big ones. That's why Ford's 1.0 liter EcoBoost can feel like a 1.6 liter monster. So liters equal engine size equal choosing your car's power? Perfect summary. Pick strong, pick efficient, or pick both. Like and subscribe for more car deep dives. You're welcome.